Good morning everyone. I decided to create a second video uh, as of right now I cannot tell you exactly which video will be also on my channel today but I have uh, many videos that is a uh, cross stitch so I decided let me whip and chat with you diamond painting gorgeous diamond painting from crafties sorry <laughs> from crafties.com and that is our gorgeous gorgeous image look at this that's the one that glow in the dark this gorgeous jellyfish uh, by do we have an artist name in here probably not okay yes it is by david loblaw loblaw okay i better show you like this so you can read and image is awesome and i already finished all the background as you can tell i did this and i already posted picture on instagram a while ago it is absolutely stunning very very sparkle also well by the way i finished this color and look at this i have full bag left i didn't even open yet and this is how much also left from another bag it's almost like two extra bags it was it was a lot i hope they're not gonna pull it out of my review but that was a good amount of diamonds this is uh, 939 dark dark blue color it's not black so this is really make me happy now i did finish already um, a few more colors in here i finished in here color uh, let me see i just finished this brown one in here uh, maybe i can show you like this one this one finished and i finished this color first one it's like a dark burgundy color this one look at this one diamonds we will place with you a b and the gems uh, so yes I'm kind of finishing a few colors more and I finished color this one color uh, no I did not finish color yet but I have to point it out something and of course um, this one clear glow in the dark diamonds I have to talk about something but I need to replace video because I record lots of video unboxing today and my battery is using a lot okay thank you for waiting me to change my battery now this is something in here that i did not tell you when i did unboxing video because basically i did not realize there is something in here new that i never see before in any diamond painting and what i'm diamond painting for four years or more now i don't know um this has happened to me first time we have in here symbol uh, which is uh, one of those diamond paintings we have in here 20 okay let me check on a canvas because when I peel out numbers from here I cannot see the uh, which one is a 20 so it would be a GO3 okay so this one color this yellow glow in the, uh, in the dark diamonds we have to place them on two symbols same diamonds but on a different background um, look at this one if we can see in here and that's what I missed on my unboxing video that I did not realize here it is we have one number for two symbols I never seen this before so I never even like pay attention when I did uh, my review and that's the minus for me I guess as a reviewer I did this mistake so anyway when I start to diamond paint and I realize like what is going on I have same symbols with two like two colors with same symbol and this yellow color will go let me show you we will have to have um, this yellow color in here and gray color which is right in here on this um, fishy right in here 
So different background. So I guess with different background, the diamonds will look different when they glow. I have no idea. So this is something very interesting. I never knew about it. So now let me just pick some color. We will work with you a little bit and let me see if we want to do something colorful, right? So maybe I'm Let's see which one color we want to do something special. Uh, I was going to do number three, symbol three. Oh yeah, we should definitely do the symbol three. And that's going to be our, this red AB colors. Mm, so pretty, so gorgeous. Let me see, by the way, this pen from uh, this website as well, Craft Ease have only one pen i think just this design uh, and one color um, now i have to point it out that i thought okay let me do quick background painting by using this 10 placer and in here on this pen if i can show you see it says 10 so this is 10 diamonds you can put on it to be honest Okay, focus, 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 focus. Did not work for me. When I started to place with this multi-placer diamonds, uh, did not fit properly on each symbol and was like off-site, did not work well. So I switched to my four-placer and it was perfect. It was right on point. And if I show you later my lines, they went so straight, so nice. And I place my diamonds, not this way, but this way, vertical. And when I place vertical, the whole thing, I think you can see later, I can show you later on, on the end, very, very close. But my lines like just like perfect straight. I didn't even use my uh, straightener. So this is not bad at all. And so many gems left and they are so sparkle. This is just amazing to me. And we don't even have a light. I turn off my lamp so it doesn't flash me over and not to disturb my camera view. So let me shake it up from side to side. And I'm just holding my hand because sometimes they jump off the tray and my canvas is open. There. Let's see that gorgeousness as close as possible. Very, very pretty, very pretty. And that would be double check. I'm just double check, triple check, symbol three, and that would be, yeah, number two. No, it's not, is it? Oh, okay, never mind. This last number in here is the quantity of the diamonds, how many you need to place. This kind of messed me up all the time. Okay, so here it is. It's a 666 triple six color, but with AB on the top. And let's get work on it. Let me bring you close to my canvas. And we will pick. Okay. No, no, a little bit more. Okay, now the it will be all right. So let's start. I'm really, really having a fun by working on this diamond painting because obviously diamonds are super, super gorgeous. Even I place this um, brown one like this list this diamonds this is not a very attractive color like not my favorite color but diamonds are so awesome they were so very very interesting to place them and let me hopefully this sheet not gonna fall on me i will put my tools on the top to hold the, i should grab my magnet that's okay Okay, so let's get work on it. We have gorgeous diamonds to place. I'm just going to double check if I'm in focus. Yes, because sometimes when I put my pen, 
and camera take after focus so if I don't catch in time I can chit chat talk and all of a sudden my camera is not focusing one stuck and flip all right so if I would work by myself right now and I want to finish quick I would definitely go with the multiplacer and place them with multiplacer. Love for placer are the best. There. So let me try. Let me try a little bit. I, I love to use my multiplacer for for placer. That way, I can finish a little bit quick together with you to actually finish this diamond painting so we have something to see in finished project now by the way somebody asked me if I finished canvas remember that city that we kind of started a little bit as a review and no I am sorry I did not have chance to work on it yet but definitely my plan is to finish, of course, this year, <laughs> as I'm trying hard to finish as many projects as possible because I don't want to drag them over to next year, especially when this project so beautiful. So yes, no, I'm sorry, I will be finishing. I know that my friend Bonnie, I think she's finished, but she definitely posted, I think, pictures on Facebook group. There's a link under my video to the group if you're interested. It should be linked up there. In here in a mixed 3 and a D, and it's not very kind of blend in a little bit to me so maybe I will use my glasses and uh, not glasses but magnifier let me crank it noisy okay that way I will see better where to place as I am not using any light and usually to work against the light it's kind of blinding you a little bit you know diamonds are so smooth like it's so looking silky I would say it's fun kind of expression for the diamond silky but that's how I feel sometimes they look smooth and shiny and even to the touch feels really nice So I think I will record this video little bit by little bit. I really would love this to be finished. So we will work with you only like with the special gems like right now. Uh, we will put some glow in the dark diamonds as well and some more. But those diamonds that I have, uh, you know, I have in here some, let me show you some colors if I can show you like this um, okay so we have in here all these colors that is not a B uh, two colors in here that just a regular color but this is the blue a B and sparkle gems up there so I would love to work with you on those ones and by myself I can place all this because they are not shiny I mean not a b's and one more beautiful color so i think we're just gonna work with you you know with the special gems like for example this one is glow in the dark for colors so yeah i will finish the other one by myself and together with you we will work with the special diamonds and time from time i will stop and keep going and then come back and record more more video because as of right now I upload in two videos at the same time to my channel and I have one more video to upload because I just recorded three videos believe it or not and while my computer working on that's what I'm trying to record this video because um, I don't want to put too much on my computer and just shut it down so I'm just right now 
while it's uploading I decide to work a little bit on this canvas and make some progress after all it's gorgeous and I would love to see finish and the most important thing I would love to see this on oh and we are off the focus how wonderful is that of me hold on let me oh camera stuck on the canvas a little bit hold on move over a little bit you have to yell on me when I go after focus you have to yell on me move slowly so yes I would love to see this on the wall to put some UV light over it or just a shut down light and see how this work in a total darkness how how much is a glow you know so that is why we need to finish and then next one I probably will be pull out the city beautiful city from crafties as well and we work on that one together because up there I just started a little bit just to show you diamonds quality or canvas uh, quality but didn't work much so it's definitely we will work on it okay I have so much fun to work on this one because of the quality of the diamonds. I feel like this diamonds even better than I was working before on a canvas. Wow, I, I don't know. I'm just it's so I'm impressed with this background. I thought that creating all this background will be very boring and annoying time. But I went like what in two nights probably and it's there's lots of background all the way you know it's uh, lots of work need to be done to create uh, all this dark corner corner so yeah no but was was actually was fun because diamonds so good that's the only thing if this diamonds would be square and not even oh that would be kind of painful to finish Okay, now I need to move where I need to move. I have some big chunk right in here. So let me work in here. I might well be sticking in here to the part that is no diamonds, but maybe not. I'm just gonna do this way. now 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 I will be finishing by myself the rest of this diamonds because we want to see more colors right and if you lift your head off your project a little bit just so we can pick a boo and I will turn light on if it's going to help just a minute let me see if this will work or not oh yeah oh yeah <laughs> oh yes look at this oh whoa isn't that awesome so my my next plan i will work i will turn off light right now i uh, will work on the symbol seven and se uh, symbol seven is number five would be 803 803 that would be very like not attractive you know well it's a regular blue color so I will finish this one and then I come back with something another color sparkle maybe blue in a B color because this one is just so pretty look at this look at this pretty I think we should work with this one next one all right see you in a second my friends let me show you what is going on in here I have like a blast of sun on my desk right now and oh my god is this ever blinding me oh so pretty and look at those a b colors let me try to wiggle them on the sun so gorgeous 
so gorgeous so I finish I place all this um, pink or red pink AB diamonds I finish this uh, three blue dark colors that's the DMC code for them and what else I think I finish one more color or, or not but anyway I was gonna tell you look at this the placement with four placer that I place I think my lines look not bad by using a only four placer for this background like one by one I did not do it um, like one by one but like just go four 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 and lines go good and the diamonds are just ridiculously sparkle oh love it this moment so now i pick for you let me just grab it here and maybe we can see a little bit on the sun as well the blue diamonds ab diamonds those ones but of course from far we will see them sparkle what is the best angle for them to sparkle oh they just play they play so we have so little bit left in here and we will be done to the end of this video so let me put my uh, camera on tripod and we will place on a simple edge right there I had to close blinds because we would be not able to see anything because they are so sparkle so here there's a little bit more of the sparks and let's do it uh, it's not very big area in here where can I put so you can see a little bit of those diamonds hmm this way <laughs> I don't know so not big area in here okay wrong pen I think this one have a little bit more wax not big area so we will be moving a little bit up and down around this canvas but I hope it's okay at least I know you will enjoy with this gorgeous gorgeous diamonds the way they look so vibrant and bright this is the baby blue that I love that's my favorite color that I remember you know being a favorite for years and years that's of course kind of pink and now I have lots of favorite colors because many new colors develop and all this bright and neon is just gorgeous. So many different colors now new on a market, right? Not like before. Was when I grew up it was pretty much boring colors. Everything was kinda of like a oh, that's a wrong symbol. And I just noticed that A, I already placed A. So I missed this one. That was 824. Eight. Where is my oh? You know what? I'm just gonna place it right now. My missing diamond. It could be more. It's not possible to pick everything. And I need to move to new place now. See that's you know what on the very end sorry to disturb you but on the other side of the canvas and I have to lift my tripod because we have I have to pull out my canvas from under I have lots in here on this edge let me just find a way let me find a way. There's a in here somewhere from the top. We will start from the top. How about that? I had to stop and flip my canvas upside down. So now it's facing you because it was difficult for me to hold the whole canvas in my hands. I was afraid it will fall on the ground. So after this one of course neighbors start to cut grass why not after this one what color should we do next what kind of ab's we did not place yet what do we have up there those blue ones well we can continue with the um, maybe a red or like a pinkish you see here 
peek in a little bit. I think that would be the color for that one. Oh no, maybe the one that we did not use yet. Anyway, I will find something. So we will create again like a first time with the, um, the other color a little bit and then I will finish. And plus I will finish some other color a little bit just to get kind of speed up a little bit and show you and more and more progress as we go. I should definitely refill my wax in here. And should I stop recording to my neighbor's finished cut lawn? Not exactly well, it's kind of across the street, but still you can hear it very well. I think you can hear Sorry for that. You know it's funny that even now Daisy, she's 10 months old, and she learned now when I record video, she's trying to be quiet. Unless she sees something in a window that is interesting for her and she tried to run to the door and see what is going on. But now, um, I need a little bit more wax. She was going to jump today from the sofa. I'm just going to refill the wax a little bit. And then she saw me turn my camera on. So it was like her front paw was already on the ground and she was was going to run towards me and then she saw that I was going to record video and she stopped halfway so her back legs like her bum was still sitting on a sofa her front feet on the ground and she stays that way and listen what I'm going to do if I'm starting to record my video or not so finally I tell her okay you know, go ahead Daisy, and she jumped and went to the door and lay down quietly next to Barry, downstairs by the front door, so it's cooler up there, you know. So I cannot believe I train my animals to be quiet when I record video, at least, you know, when they see I'm starting to record. Otherwise, they would be just jumping around if I don't tell them to go lay down. But they're doing great, so that that's good. That's good. She's still little. She likes to run back and forth sometimes. And I know you told me many times that that's okay if you hear her in the background. But I'm still not feel comfortable when she does. Because I like my video to be a little bit more, you know, professional, they say. Instead of a whole bunch of noises in the background. Oh, th this is the, uh, why are we going off the focus? I think my, the, the sun seeping through the blinds and made this kind of, mm, this is the top of the jellyfish because you're looking at right now, it's facing you. So look at this, all those stripes sparkle will be on the top of the head of the jellyfish. Isn't that going to be gorgeous? Very pretty. So when I work after camera, I work with four placers. So that way you kind of, I can finish quickly. So I'm so excited because this is going to be another finish that was in my whips. I'm trying to clear up as much as possible but at the same time there's lots of need to be started especially we need to work on Halloween stuff Okay, let's see. Let's see. Lift up your eyes to the cam to the screen. You see how nice and bright. Love, love, love. 
very much so okay we are going to move a little bit to the side which has big area of these diamonds so we will move this way just a minute I will readjust a little bit I have many in here oh it's getting darker the sun went behind a cloud and can you tell it's getting darker for the camera usually my camera not bad on photo focus no, out of focus I should say out of focus now it sounds back and it's diamonds looks brighter I keep forgetting to mention but anyway I'm, I'm saying this in many many videos uh, please check for the discount and with crafties I do have a discount code for 20% it's uh, not 20 off I believe uh, check it out the link is in the description box so you can save 20% on order whatever you order if you wish to save some money I order another very very colorful um, design from Craft Ease and it's already on my way. I think so. So we should get soon. They have a big selection of paint by numbers. They really need to bring more diamond paintings, I think. I think they have more paint by numbers than diamond painting. And I just love the variety of diamonds on the canvases. That's why it's a little bit more expensive, plus it's licensed to the artist. Artists all licensed. They pay commission to people who created this art. Which is wonderful, right? And we're getting like so many different diamonds in here. Very good quality. When you refill it, it's always kind of sticking out. You have to tuck it back. So we will create this little, uh, this little corner in here. Let me move over camera like this. A little bit corner in here, and then we do like last time, or maybe even right now, I will see. Oh, this is big chunk of this pink. Maybe that's what we're gonna work on it right now, so I, I don't have to flip my canvas back and forth. And we will play some glow-in-the-dark diamonds as you can tell that glow-in-the-dark diamonds doesn't have a symbol behind on the canvas because they are transparent if we would have a symbol right in we would see that through the diamonds because diamonds are very very kind of see-through so that's why all spots that no symbols it's where our diamonds that glow-in-the-dark go we will place them so 
such a beautiful shine whatever they put some kind of like a, a foil glitter whatever it is that tapping on the top of the diamond so pretty okay how far you can see that way and we will stop here okay um okay few more we see here okay good we done this corner that's okay we have in here but you know what just for the time saving because I really want you to enjoy with all the sparkles as much as possible so let me put these diamonds back into container and I will grab wherever the pink one will go and that would be I believe let's see G06 G06 okay let me show you let me show you Mm -hmm. Can you focus? Come on. Okay, let me shake off the camera. I mean, yes, off the canvas. I want it, say, because I don't want this fall on a. Okay. Here it is. Our diamonds. And we will move camera a little bit more forward lots of readjustment but that's what we need to do sorry about that okay I will try my best okay the sun a little bit out can we open a little bit more window let's try it or it's going to be too much light I don't know maybe sun move a little bit over it's pretty much fast go okay so now I wonder let me see I know it's a little bit too bright and it's very very bright but I have in here a flashlight that has uh, three four settings and I will put my UV light in here this purple lights for the glow diamond so that's that's how it's supposed to glow you see that that's how it's gonna glow at night not much we probably gonna see now as mm, no that's not gonna work like this it's too bright in here but anyway <laughs> that's the idea to have glow diamonds but anyway on a night time after I finish the whole thing and I see some something from the canvas probably some glue or something hold on can't pull it out time from time i keep peeling my like a puppy hair oh the sun sun okay sun destruction well let's i guess place on a sunny spot in here maybe i can put tray next to it not sure this is going to be good let's try it because usually sun triggering and Catherine's getting very loud she probably gonna come in here she don't know I'm recording video no definitely I need a more wax this is doesn't work to me not enough I should put just fresh one when I try to refill in the same spot not always work maybe I will have to do not sure if I put any new or not. I might need to do the um, um, what I want to say. Okay, just a minute. All right. Here it is. I had to close blinds, and I had to tell Catherine that I'm recording video because she was getting loud and loud. I guess they chit chatting with girlfriends from school. 
you know what they do and sometimes they do in uh, workout through the FaceTime and they do workout together from their houses you know facing each other and that's great great idea for young kids to keep shape they are so transparent it's hard to see that we, we even place in them right okay oh daisy decided to move call it down baby girl she is here and a Catherine talking up there so she went to check it out what is going on okay can't even see them <laughs> We can't even see them. Is it possible to get a little bit more close? This is really actually difficult to record video with these diamonds because they are so transparent. I'm afraid my camera kind of feels like it's out of focus a little bit. Because when I'm looking at diamonds in here, it was looked like it's out of the focus. So that's okay. You don't have to look right now. Just do whatever you're doing. I will let you know where to look up. Looks like you are liking this idea when I tell you when to look so you can check it out what is going on in here and what new we placed. I was um, doing, I was cross stitching and I finished my mushrooms uh, number three. So I still have one more to go. Uh, check out the uh, post on my Instagram. If you not follow me on Instagram yet, please join. Lovecraft Forever XO. And up there, usually I upload something that doesn't go on a YouTube channel as fast. This could be picture posted up there. So those uh, three mushrooms that I already stitched. And by the way, I prove company provided me with the um, discount code for you for two months from now and they will be changing code after new year again so yes i will be linked up somewhere actually i will put new discount code in the description box that would be for wizardy if you want to check those mushrooms so i have one more to go That is pretty, but less visible. <laughs> less visible. That, that's fun to work with them. It's almost like placing a gel candy. Jello. There. Now I have to save a little bit more time because we do need to place more sparkle diamonds that is... Um, like an orange color and I have two colors of them red and kind of orange so I will not place like all the way in here or you know what or maybe I will let me try to speed up this process with my multiplacer usually when I use multiplacer like this is would be vertical so I put canvas horizontal to me and that way my lines will go vertical more perfect but I will I will try to do it this way I'm doing kind of like a uh, walk in motion put first diamond then walk a little bit let's see it doesn't stick all the way three I need the new wax I need new wax course much faster with this there not sure if I'm doing a straight or not have to move canvas a little bit away from me okay so should we just finish this one part because it kind of doesn't it's not much left okay I barely see 
this diamonds to be serious because in here we have a pink wax pink pink beads I can't even see them <laughs> it's like placing with blindfolded that is so funny and I don't think this light would be a good idea just a minute sometimes work sometimes don't okay you can see diamonds this way better but actually I will see diamonds a little bit better so maybe you forgive me if I will put few of them this way with the light so we can move to the next color and then I will finish totally finish and come back to you with finished design and hopefully tomorrow we will have some more sunlight so I can take a video outside because all the time I finish this one the sun will be gone so I'm not gonna see uh, the sparkles that I wanted to see I will have to fix this one a little bit and I'm sticking in here maybe a few of them I will have to place a little bit horizontal way because it's not comfortable for me in this direction okay I will try I will try to do this way but I would definitely recommend to do horizontal lines instead of no vertical lines instead of horizontal because that's uh, how our eyes see in a first so if your lines not straight that's what you're gonna see so that's why important to place them vertical more straight than horizontal so right now I'm trying to be as precise as possible and I'm closing probably everything with my hand am I oh, big shadow oh why didn't you say so why didn't you say so that was bad okay and it's very dark I have to open window I have to wait till sun change the direction I guess because it's brutal I know I'm complaining right now sounds like too much but I'm having a fun I'm having a fun here I like this cute gems okay one more in here and that's it I'm gonna place something else right now now I will open blinds because we okay with that for now let me show you what we have very wiggle now this diamond I'm looking at right now this one looks like could be not stick flat and I was right see now it's gone so when you that's what happened with multiplacer so I'm just like okay this one when you're rubbing with your finger you can feel it which diamond don't stick now can you look and check it out look how gorgeous they like berries so pretty <laughs> of course they still sparkle but they are not supposed to sparkle they're supposed to glow so we're not gonna have the same sparks as we would have you know from different diamonds but I will wait till sun go a little bit away or something because we still have this kind of gorgeous color to place you see those red ones and which one there's a two colors in here let me show you we have see those two colors one is a little bit darker one is brighter this one kind of like a glowy orange and this one more like a raspberry so this is the color that this one we have and the orange one we probably placed some of them on the bottom maybe we didn't even place this one I don't think we even used this one yet so I will be working with some other color and come back to you with gems after sun go away a little bit because it's bugging me see you soon we are down to two colors here's the next gems that we will work on a symbol D I am so super excited because now we are going to the finishing line 
and this is actually now next day from recording the first part and looks like it's going to be sunny day so there is a possibility we will see sparkle on the end of this video even that was pretty on a table from the sun last night that I recorded and I did um, recorded what I wanted to say well when I was recorded in the s sunshine when the table hit it was beautiful already but till I finished some kind of all those colors it was already night and I didn't want it to finish this diamond painting at night time because the light and the shadow you know what I'm thinking about when when I create diamond painting with artificial light from the top or the side way it create lots of shadow from my hand so I don't like that I decided just finish the rest of the color uh, put some also color like this color on the canvas as well more um, like in the spots with like one here two here three there so it's left in here like a little chunks so I don't have to move camera too far away and one more color that will be left it's another red gems this one kind of more like a pink raspberry color the other one more red I think or that's the one like an orange one uh, yeah something like that and last night when I turn off the light to see if they glow oh they are glow they were glow but still wasn't enough um, like wasn't dark dark because I try to see how this looks like at night but next to my computer so I did have some extra light from computer but I already saw the colorful um, have its glow a little bit I have to say the pink color probably at least that glow the most glow it's a blue and some yellow or white what was that and now that give me idea that I cannot really oh no I can go to dark room and finish this video so I can catch the glow maybe I will put this diamond painting on a hanger like a clothes hanger and put and go to the bathroom because that's the only room that has no window and see if I can catch this on video the glow in the dark usually camera not picking up as much as I would do like as I see it with my own eyes Okay, now I have to move my canvas to the other spot so let's go for a right let's go for a right we have in here spots in here okay just I'm just gonna look after focus I have it three gems just next to me here all right let me just double check if I'm in camera for this one episode okay I changed my pen right now it was here blue tack before now I just changed to the pink wax I want to see how this work for this diamond so it looks okay so this create noises listen kind of satisfying I have to say that each color 
of colors uh, from this diamond painting good amount of gems left over the good news is we did not run out of any diamonds oh you see this there's a second color in here actually right now you cannot see it because what I'm looking at for you looks like the same color but let me flash it for you in a second okay look up everybody we will see some two colors there you see how it's okay now you can see that this is orange and a pink so that's the second color that we will place with you in a second we are moving 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 to this this side and all that symbol for that's the orange diamonds that we need to place so just a little bit more in here of the d's oh. Okay, on 19th, I have two videos for you. If you miss one, please check it out. I decided to post two videos because they are totally different. One was kind of like a fun unboxing review of more like for the kitchen stuff product that I can use from my cooking channel okay I'm out of the focus so you can see that just a little bit in here on the bottom oh I think now we are in the frame that we will see that that's all is left that's all is left so I guess when I start to add all those pieces together the video will be probably long maybe hour long I'm not sure I can't remember now how much I already uh, recorded hopefully my computer or camera not gonna have any difficulties to process my video properly Okay, I can see that I need a little bit more wax because when I place just um, I dig out the old wax from my pen and I replace new ones so sometimes need it twice twice to get you know so just one more time because I go deeper into the pen in here Do we see do we see anywhere else? No, I think it's only left now one color. Oh my goodness, is it really? Then I will look through the window and see if I miss any symbols. No, I think I put last night everything that I needed. Alright, so after camera in here, I'm gonna put my gems back into the tray. So that's another color that is left. So this is all already my all leftovers diamonds in here. And let me grab my last last color that we will work today, and that is this orange. That's all diamonds. That's all the diamonds that in the tray I have. Look how pretty glowing. Depends on the tray how I put. Okay, so let's finish strong. Let's finish strong. And then we will go outside. 
Uh, maybe I will wait a couple hours. It's still it's morning. It's only nine o'clock in the morning. So the sun is out, but it's not as glassed in, in the high point beam yet. So I have to wait till it's get a little bit more to my backyard, so I can put this canvas in the grass. And hopefully, nobody gonna cut grass or something, make a noises. I'm usually very lucky on that. It feels so good to get like one more canvas to the end, to the finish. This is, was very pleasure to work on. Diamonds gorgeous, and especially when you have a mix of different kind of gems, it's even double fun to work on you should definitely order this one to support artist of course if you like sea world this kind of underwater images see by myself I would finish this in seconds because I would use my multiplacer but I decided oh let me just leave one more hold on I'm just trying to get it works a little bit up there I just decided let me do slow to finish together with you. Finish and touches, it's always exciting to do together. I hope you had fun diamond paint together with me. And then definitely I will be working on the city as well to boost and finish a little bit faster definitely we need to finish this year not year from now because soon will arrive November kit for me to work with you so I should finish the other one as well I will be um, running See, I'm working on a soft surface because I have a mat behind the canvas. So sometimes when I place diamonds and I push harder and the other diamonds kind of coming out because um, the way the diamond go like soft on the surface, that's why after finishing I always roll my diamonds on a hard surface like dining table where I do my unboxings now to just make sure they are all flat on a glue. Ladies and gentlemen, drum roll, last diamond there. We are finished. We are finished. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, we are finished. So now let me get you off the tripod and we will see the whole canvas, how it looks like close up a little bit. I already rolled my diamonds. So they all flat and I have a couple of different of these rollers so it's great work to do on the diamonds now here is all our diamonds that we have left you can see the each color lots of diamonds up there and lots of glow on the, on, uh, glow on the dark diamonds left up there now the most amount was left is the, for the background because I didn't even need it to open one pack that's wonderful and from another one that's how much left and here it is our image new jellyfish big fish by david loblaw if i pronounce it right 50 by 40 centimeters and now let's see those colorful colorful jellyfish look how gorgeous that look like so bright 
and I cannot wait to go outside and show you this diamond painting in a sparkle way so we have in here gorgeous AB diamonds glow in the dark diamonds glow in the dark white glow in the dark pink glow in the dark blue and here is the spot that we place same diamonds but on two different symbols remember here is here is the one that number 20 we have same gems for two symbols so here is how they look like this is yellow one glow in a dark on a yellow background and the same gems go for the gray background that that's the one see how much difference they look like so of course when we turn off the light it creates different shade of yellow kind of less powerful so that's kind of interesting that i never have like this before one symbol on a i mean one color of diamonds and two different symbols so here it is those gorgeous ab blue diamonds two kind of gems we can see good in here right let's see this pink and orange up there lots of ab look there's lots of ab diamonds there looks so beautiful and also lots of ab in here right on the top and that's where we placed with you last night when i was working look at those diamonds aren't they precious and look at the quality of the diamonds you see how how round one to one there's like same size same for this uh, dark one you see that there's like identical so good so good really really love it and i really love how this image popping out of this canvas with this black not black dark blue background but it looks like a, almost like a black this shade of color 939 pretty much looks like black to me well now let me try to see we are gonna create maybe glow in the dark first and then I will wait for you hours for more sun and start to upload this video lovely 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 all right my friends didn't work what I wanted but I brought with me UV flashlight and I can show you magic right now there with the help of the flashlight that's the actual glow that I see not of course as bright without UV light but I mean look at this glow that is gorgeous I even can see right now like even this um, pink gems kind of sparkle glow but that's the idea see if you have a, a home somewhere like a lamp to point over this diamond painting with the uh, UV light over a, this is how it looks like look at this um, yellow how they glow in here nice and bright and the fish it's lighter make a stripes um, this blue of course glow nice in here to me looks like almost green from here from the from far away and of course it's a sparkle 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 oh look like if I take it from the bottom oh look at the, the sparks even we can see this pink pink gems gorgeous now let's go outside and now we are outside we can enjoy gorgeous sparkle sorry if you hear some noises people cut grass I wish I would have more birds singing for you but here we can see how this look 
when it's finished and it's outside right now I can't really see myself how much it sparkle because it's too bright I might have to change a little bit the position of the canvas but I think you can see how beautiful that is maybe from another side more sparkles I don't know absolutely gorgeous a little bit windy outside sorry for that color so vibrant is the dark background love it don't forget to use discount code to save 20 percent on your order link will be under this video have a good day everyone